this video we're going to show how to install the Zerto Cloud Appliance Update 1. Uh, this update has some uh, cool features, one of which is being able to choose an existing storage account in Azure. So here we're going to open up the uh, installer and then it will launch the installation process. And it's a, bit, it's a wizard, so it's very easy to do. Select the license agreement. I'm sure you've read all of it. And it's a next, next, next operation. We have uh, options there where you can go custom or just we're going to use a standard. First thing you do is authenticate in Azure. You need an Azure account to do that, obviously. So I'm going to log in here. Once I get logged in, I'm going to choose a subscription I want to use, and I'm going to pick the subscription that has the storage account already created because I'm going to use that option. So I'm going to drop down, and this is a bunch of different subscriptions that that uh, are available to me. I'm going to choose the right one, and then I'm instead of using uh, the create new storage account, which the Zerto Cloud Appliance will do, I'm going to use an existing one. So I'm going to go to one that I created already because I want my uh, ZCA to go there. And there it is. And then hit next. And if you have multiple NICs on the ZCA, then you'll see a drop down list. I've got one on this one. Then I'm going to give it a name. Something creative like ZCA. Hit next and then uh, watch the installation process. This uh, allows you to check the box for Zerto Analytics, which is very cool. If you haven't seen that, go to the Zerto site. Everything checks out, and then you hit Install, and it starts running the MSI installer. Now, you get this VM from the Azure Marketplace. So uh, if you've got a Marketplace account, if you type in Zerto, then it will pop up, and you just de deploy the Marketplace VM, and you'll get to this configuration installer wizard that uh, we're using in this video. All right, so the rest here is just uh, pretty quick as far as the installation goes. It's it's getting things lined out just about done. Then the next step is it'll finish up. We'll log into the ZCA, make sure everything's happy. Okay, it's about wrapped up here. Okay, let's hit done. And then we're going to also open up the uh, management interface because we want to check out the lovely Zerto dashboard. Okay, I'm going to log in with the account that I created when I created the Marketplace VM. That would be an administrator account. Um, you could have other accounts already created that uh, you could use, but on this one I just had one. So I'm going to log in with that one. And then I'll uh, paste in my license. And that's it. It starts, and I'm ready to pair it to an on-premises site. And that's all it is to install the ZCA.